this video on my top companies i want to be clear about this the hair that i'm going to be talking about they are not as affordable as my aliexpress vendor video the first hair i got was from keisha anderson here on youtube um her hair company is called got blunt so i got this hair and um, i'm also going to put pictures of me in the hair i own braid the hair it looked great i had no issues with the hair um she always has like a sale going on most of the time coupon code if you watch her videos she'll let you know about the sale but just go to the website there'll always be something at the top will say um if you spend 200 dollars, you'll get off 50 dollars or 40 dollars or something like that so i find her sales are very good they last for a very long time and i planned on um ordering more hair but i never got around to it because you know sometimes i'll get cheaper hair sometimes i'll get more expensive hair it just depends on what's going on so this hair either ran between 180 and 250 but i believe it was more on the lesser side and to me some of the hair on aliexpress will run you 200 dollars. so if you're gonna pay that much for that kind of hair you might as well just get quality hair so i highly recommend that hair definitely check her um channel out and also check out her website she always has sales like i said before and yeah there you go so got lymphs that's the hair i just mentioned um check out the website and you'll see everything she has to offer there i, I want to get the island wave here i love how that look on right along um this company I actually ordered from them twice once i ordered russian straight hair i'm gonna try to put a picture if i have one i actually colored that hair that was hair it was pretty pretty hard for me to color unfortunately but that hair was amazing the bundles came thick and everything flush extensions is the name of the brand you probably didn't hear from them and they're another vendor that you'll find uh coming out of down south area um the hair is kind of aliexpress prices but the quality is not the same the quality is really really good so my first experience with the hair like i said i had russian straight i ombre the hair the hair was good quality i didn't have shedding i have tangling the hair was just beautiful um from beginning to end even after i colored the hair but i did order recently i think this was last year um, I ordered in January of last year. I actually colored the hair red. I believe I bleached. I'm gonna put some pictures up here. The red came out really good. The hair was still soft and everything like that. But the problem with that, I don't know what happened. I don't know if their quality went down or anything like that, but the hair was just not the same. Um, it lasted for a while. I did end up selling the hair. And all the hair that I'm talking to you right now, I did end up selling most of it. More than likely, I did not probably reinstall it. If I did, I reinstalled it one time a couple on this list that i did reinstall but i do sell my hair after i finish wearing it because i just i don't know i don't even if it's quality hair i usually don't reinstall it i sell it i'm gonna make a video coming up next after this one about how i sell my virgin hair how i make a lot of money moving along i have pasta Diddy hair that hair company is actually located in new york and queens you can actually go to the store and get that hair look it over i like that some of the companies do have a store that you can actually go to and look at the hair feel it see the different textures and everything like that this hair is the most expensive hair on this list this hair ran me about 400 dollars, but this hair lasted me for so long even the sewing that i had got with the hair lasted me like over the amount of time i was supposed to wear i was supposed to take it out but i don't think i had money to get my hair done or something was going on and this hair really held me down i have no complaints about this hair it was um some kind of wavy hair i forget now but i straightened it and it was just bomb all the way through i love that hair so much so hasta Diddy hair check out their website the hair is expensive i'm telling you that now but it is quality hair for sure i had no issues with it if you're looking to spend some coin definitely go to hasta Diddy hair up is gonna be hair by bell brie that hair so i bought hair from them twice the first time i bought the hair from them i had got i think it was like a body wave or a wavy hair texture i actually dyed the hair like a brownish color i'm gonna put pictures up next to me and that hair ran me about 250 dollars mind you i had no closure so if you're gonna get a closure it's gonna rent you a lot more than that first batch i was highly highly upset if i spent all that money do they do have sales here and there I'm not sure if I got the hair on sale or not, but it doesn't matter if the hair is supposed to be the same quality all the way through, whether it's on sale or it's not on sale. So that hair I was really, really upset about. Body wave hair, I don't recommend, but 
I had bought more hair and that hair was curly and I actually bleached that hair. That hair was amazing. I wore it literally throughout the whole summer. I never straightened the hair, but the hair was so good. I would actually buy that hair again, the curly hair, just because of the way that it was, the quality, the texture, the way it looked after I bleached it. I got so many compliments on it. It lifted easily. I just love that hair. So I would recommend their curly hair or wavyish hair, but body wave, I would not. So that once again, that was hair by Belt Free. Ran me about $250 and I did get pretty long lips. I think I got a 24 inch in the curly and yeah, so. And coming up next is glitzy hair. So glitzy hair, I have a video on that as well. That's more of the recent hairs that I had experienced. Um, that hair really worked out well for me. The hair was, I believe, some type of curly texture, wavy texture as well. I never colored it. Um, the hair was really good quality. We had a little bit of shedding here and there, but I actually went to the store to get that hair. The store they have, I believe they have one in Bronx, Queens, and I forget where else. I think Jamaica, the actual country Jamaica. So the hair is quite expensive, but they said it would last you about three years, which I don't know because once again, I sold that hair. That hair was actually the hair that bought the ear pods that's in my ear right now. So I sold that hair along with the closure from Supernova that I wore with my big old bundles hair. You cannot wear that hair straight. That was my only con about the hair. The hair, when you put it straight, it looked it so ugly. Like I don't even know how else to say it, but you cannot wear that hair straight. And I was really looking for a wavy hair that I could wear straight as well but that's not it but i would definitely recommend their hair their closures are another story i paid about 110 for a closure and it shed um it balded and it shed horribly i found that my supernova closure i paid about 65 dollars for was way better than the glitzy hair closure so the hair i recommend highly definitely for sure i would get hair from them again because it's so convenient just to go right up to the store next up is um hair that was kind of popular on youtube called virgin head hair i found it on one of the big youtubers channels so i decided to try it out because it's some good quality hair i had got the hair in exquisite wave i think it was about 200 dollars um i dyed the hair it was really really difficult to dye i would never get that hair again if i'm going to color i colored it red i'm going to show you um pictures on the side of me um uh, the quality was okay. The price was, like I said, about $200 around there. I did not get a closure, but I don't think I would get that hair again unless I gave a different texture a try, but I did not really enjoy that hair as much as I thought that I would. And for the price, I don't think I would like risk my money again. So problem I had with that hair was I had used L'Oreal High Color. I think it was Chroma Reds that I bought from Sally's and I literally dyed the hair like five, six times and it was supposed to lift, but it did not, it just kept getting darker and darker. So I got my hair done and I was just mad. I just didn't like the way it looked. So I liked the install, but I didn't like the color. So I came home and I was like, I gotta do something about it. So I literally just threw bleach on my hair. And as I was bleaching it, the color started lifting out and becoming the red that I wanted it to be. But you shouldn't have to do all of that when you paid all that money. It should lift if it's virgin hair. But obviously, I don't know what's going on with their hair. But So virgin head hair, I don't. It's a 50-50 on them, but I don't think I'll buy it again from them. So their hair company hair. So you, I'm sure you heard of her hair company throughout the years. People claim that their quality went down. I had hair from them twice. When I had the straight hair, I loved that hair. Like that was my best straight virgin hair that I ever, ever had. Um, Hasa Diddy hair was good too, but uh, her hair company I like better, especially for the price. The price would run you about, I would say, I would say between 180 and 200, depending on the lengths that you get. I always get 16, 18, 20. So I had got the straight hair, colored it. The hair is a little, little bit hard to color. Um, I colored it blonde. I had a bit of a trouble trying to get that blonde that I got. You'll see in the clips in the videos next to me. So yeah, I had that hair installed it. I had it for about maybe, I think, probably installed like two months like oh, I revisited the hair. I always keep the hair. I didn't sell that hair, I kept it. I revisited it like a year later and I actually was like, this is still pretty good hair. So I said, I'm gonna bleach it a little bit lighter. So in total, I bleached the hair four times and I installed it twice and the hair was still good and I still sold the hair after that. So that hair is definitely quality. I would definitely recommend her hair company to straight. 
So moving on to the wavy hair. The wavy hair, I would not recommend that hair. It bleached fine, nothing was wrong with it, but I just didn't like how it was. Once again, I could not um, wear that hair bone straight either. I have no idea why I can't wear the wavy hair bone straight, which was strange. Um, actually, my Asteria Virgin hair that I had, I did end up straightening that hair like you saw in my last video, but that hair shed it so bad. That was the only loose wave hair I ever could wear straight and wavy at the same time, basically. Not the same time, but you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, um, and the thing that uh, her hair company has is they have these things called like, I forget what they're called. They're like specialty bundles where they're like really cheap. I guess it's like the reject hair, if you want to say that. And they sell them for pretty, pretty cheap, but they're always sold out. I wouldn't recommend getting it, but if you need something fast and you don't want to go to AliExpress because of all the virus talk that's going around, I would definitely recommend something like that. But her hair company, straight hair, I would highly recommend. Um, wavy, I would not get that again. But definitely straight hair was like one of my top favorites. I'm not going to have much to say about this hair because I absolutely loved it. I still have it. I'm about to put it in my video where I am going to be selling that hair. So this hair is Big Old Bundles. So Big Old Bundles, I wanted to try it for a long time. I heard mixed reviews about it, so I wanted to see for myself. So in the Big Old Bundles hair, I got... Um, either got body wave or loose wave i have to check but yeah i got that hair i did not get a closure because the closure was too expensive i didn't get a closure from them i got a closure from supernova hair as you'll see in the video next to me i loved it i was able to color the hair no problem um i had not really any shedding from the hair the hair i heat style almost every single day still didn't have a problem i could still literally put that hair in my head and head now and everything would be good so I would highly recommend Big Old Bundles. And the thing I like about them is that they can do same day service if you want to get your hair delivered. So if you live in New York or New Jersey, they'll drive to you same day. You have to text them and they will bring you your hair. I have not tried that service, but um, hopefully it's good. <laughs> um, they don't have a store, which I was disappointed about. I thought they did have a store, unless they actually do have a store in the Bronx, but that's a little bit too far for me to travel to to get hair. The only thing that I did not like was the shipping the shipping was a little bit long i think it was like between five and seven days and if it's a um holiday it's between 10 and 14 days so definitely not a holiday i'm sorry if it's a sale it's between 10 and 14 days so definitely keep that in mind if you're gonna buy because they always have a sale they email me constantly about the sales that they have um etc etc so yeah so i was getting nervous about my hair coming so i called them i guess the owner actually answered the phone i'm not really sure but he um, had really good customer service, so I was really impressed with that. The hair came, no smell, no nothing. I was really happy with it, and I always tell people, oh, if you need hair, go to Big Old Bundles. Go to Big Old Bundles. So yeah, that's my list of my top virgin hairs. I'll go through it one more time. So got Lems, Keisha Anderson. I definitely highly recommend that. Plush extensions, I'm 50-50 on that. Buy that at your own risk um let's see hostility hair i recommend it but it's very expensive hair by bella brie i recommend but the curly hair only not the body wave um glitzy hair i recommend it i would try it again i just would not get a closure from them at all and her hair company i recommend the straight not the wavy so if you're gonna buy the wavy definitely be careful do your research and look at other um videos besides mine and of course big old bundles I highly recommend that. That's like my number one hair out of any virgin hair that I had. So happy with that hair and I will be ordering from them again. So if you have any questions, leave them down below. Let me know what other videos you want to see besides hair videos or if you want to see more hair videos. Let me know you guys how I sell my hair coming up next. I'm going to be wearing the same shirt the same day. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.